Good evening. My name is Steven Eisenberg. I'm from Indianapolis, Indiana. I'm a, I'm a physician, and one day when I was making hospital rounds, I entered the room of one of my patients who was struggling for his life. Once again, I witnessed the medal, M-E-T-T-L-E, -E, the resolve, courage, and bravery that it takes when patients are in these conditions. Metal is what it takes when you face the challenges of life. I placed the medal that I had received just the day before from a marathon around his neck and Medals for Metal was born. At Medals for Metal, endurance athletes from around the world send their medals to my medical office and from there we disperse them across the world. When we do, we put this flashy bling rhythm, ribbon on them. And when the children see these in the hospital, they light up from a day that was otherwise very dark for them. Since 2005, we have now 65 worldwide chapters. 30,000 medals have been awarded in over 70 US hospitals. School, children's, school children are now running so that they can earn medals to gift to other children. Medals have been awarded to the Kenya Peace Run. Medal exchanges have occurred between countries such as Japan and Finland. And US soldiers just recently awarded medals in Korea to children in hospitals. I have personally awarded medals to children in London and Paris. And worldwide, the response is the same. Some sunshine in my day, some reason to believe I'm not alone, and some encouragement to fight on. I want to thank the thousands of Medals for Metal volunteers, donors, recipients who've made this all possible, because certainly I could not do it myself. Many of them I've never met. Most of them I've never met. It's all by the internet. It's by communication with text messaging. It's by pi pictures we send each other. So Medals for Metal is a simple idea with incredible volunteers, generous donors, and powerful impact. Thank you very much.